What's up, guys? I'm on the road again. Just snagged a coffee. This place is called Crimson Cup. I know what it is. I got some kind of mocha. It's pretty good. So when you have something that you can't find the calories for, what I'll do is like I'll just find the Starbucks comparable, and I always get fat-free everything and the sugar-free options of whatever they have. So the calories said it was like 300, so it's really like 200. Uh, my calories today are 3,000. For breakfast, I had Kodiak oats, peanut butter powder, uh, one serving of frozen fruit, and a cup of Fairlife milk. And then I had a Bear, a Bear Bells protein bar, the chocolate one, on the way to the event. My daughter is in a gymnastics event all day today. Then we're gonna go out to lunch, probably get some kind of chicken, and then uh, end off the day with some kind of beef, probably something. There's like an anime show going on here right now too, so there's a bunch of crazy stuff going on. Some dude asked me if my tattoo was real. I think it's because uh, the anime shit's going on, but. That'd be crazy to take the time to make all this stuff. I guess like, people do that for um, costumes. So today, I'm gonna show you guys like a full day of eating. I know I missed the first two, but I told you guys, and then I'm sipping on this coffee. And then I'm going to show you guys exactly what I'm gonna do to hit my macros by the end of the day. I'm gonna add this coffee in there. I'm at around 700 calories right now, give or take. I don't know the exact ones at the moment. At the end of the day, it'll be 3,000 calories, and I'll show you guys exactly what my macro breakdown is at the end of the day. It's just about staying consistent. I travel all the time, and I still hit my macros no matter what. People say they can't do it because they're too busy, but I promise you I'm probably one of the busiest people you will ever meet. Not only do I travel a lot, I have three kids, three dogs, a busy uh, social media that I have to run my business through. My wife is a swing shift nurse, so she works off shifts like third so she sleeps during the day, works at night, so I'm pretty much a full-time dad while I'm running my business, while my wife works or sleeps. She's gonna retire in April when we move. She's gonna be coaching with me full-time, but she had just started this job. She really likes it, so she's gonna stay there until we get out of Ohio. And, well, I leave in April, so you guys will see just me from April to the end of May while my kids finish school. I'm going to Texas first. We do have something going on medically with one of our kids that could maybe prevent us from moving um, at least for right now depending on how serious it is it, they don't act like it's that serious but I just I'm just in case um, just because I know how sometimes life goes so if you guys can say some somewhat of a prayer for my son nothing serious yet but it's just some kind of, he has a growth inside of his mouth that they found that has doubled in size since his last orthodontist. And it looks kind of, uh, it doesn't look the greatest. So just keep that in mind. I know this is the Better By The Day series. And I showed you guys about moving, like the personal development side of things and how I'm actually gonna move forward with my moving and doing all these cool things in my life because of personal development. But if I have to put moving on the back burner to keep my son here, to go to doctor's visits to see what's going on. His first visit's in uh, Monday, what we call and get a schedule. He just went to the orthodontist Thursday, which was yesterday, so or two days ago now. So that's just an update there. So I'm gonna go in back in here. I'm gonna show you guys exactly what my daughter does for gymnastics, probably show you guys our floor routine, and then I'll come back for a meal later. I just wanna show you guys a day in the life. This is all this is gonna be really. I don't really have any motivational speeches or anything crazy or any kind of story. I just wanna show you guys how busy my life is and I still stay on track so you guys can too. It's kind of relatively loud and there's a lot of people around so I'm not sure how the quality of the video is gonna sound, but. Just keep in mind it is going to be a very busy day, very productive day. There's a lot of people walking in and out, and I keep looking at all these uniforms from these people in the anime. So just stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, and let's get this day rocking. I think it's like 10 o'clock so far. We had to be here at 7, so we got up at 5. So it's been a long day already. Let's go.
seventh is Macy P for Global. We have a tie for fifth. Taking sixth is Adley T for Vitality. Taking fifth is Kinsley N for Vitality. In fourth is Araya C from HOA. In third is Dayla P from HOA. We have I got something called the Big Thumper. My daughter got mac and cheese and french fries. Cheese and queso. Filthy fajita. Filthy fajita. These are really not ready. That's my wife. I'm actually married to two people because she has multiple personalities. All right, so my calories are 3,000 calories, 330 carbs, 240 proteins, and 80 fats. I'll have to guess on this because it's not like a, a chain restaurant. So when I get home today, I'm also gonna have some egg whites and a protein shake right after the gym. It's almost two o'clock. By the time I get home, it'll be three, workout. I have my last meal around six or seven, which would be egg whites and a protein shake. Just scoff off the rest of the protein I need. And I probably won't hit my carbs, but I definitely hit my fats. And that's how you can enjoy your life, still tracking your macros. Still going out and doing things. But this is how my life normally goes. Travel places to places, and this is how I lost over 110 pounds by staying consistent in my macros. Now I'm up, I'm up in my calories as I'm reverse dieting out up to 200 pounds, as you guys know. Then I'm gonna get into the 8% body fat within the next year. So it's a it's an ongoing game. But this is the day in the life, just with the family. I, got, I have another daughter and a son, but they didn't want to come, so they're with their grandma today. So make sure you subscribe, and as always, do better.